into the dining room. This is probably one of my favorite rooms in the house, not only because I love to cook and entertain family and friends, but because it's got a lot of really cool elements that you find in old homes like this. Um, floor to ceiling windows that lead out to porches, and when you have a really big party here and it's like cramped and you can't move, we sneak outside, go around the house on the porch, and come in the kitchen and get food and sneak back out and go around. Um, this fireplace was made, allegedly, in 1852 by a marble craftsman that came with the owner from England. Um, the marble man apparently came from Italy and was quite a craftsman. He did this beautiful carving work on the uh, marble fireplaces in the house, and there are three. And again, this is the white marble that we took the clue to be able to put white marble in the kitchen. But one of the neatest things about this is it's a starburst. So if you watch the veins of the marble, they mirror one another. And that's apparently because they cut into the marble, like s sliced it open, laid it apart, and the veins mirror each other. And then they were able to create the um, fireplace using that piece of marble. Um, again, we know this house was coal-fired, wood-fired. Um, there's a coal furnace in the basement. Now we're on... Um, regular heating fuel, but we do use these and they do throw a decent amount of heat even though they were built in 1852. Um, sometimes the simple engineering is the best. So um, what can I tell you about this room? We <laughs> tried seven colors of yellow before we got one that we liked and one of the failures my husband called conflict yellow. So obviously that wasn't a good shade to keep um, in the dining room when you're trying to <laughs> entertain people, but this color came from a Pharaoh and Ball um, palette, and I think it was called some, something, you know, pleasant morning or beautiful morning or something, and the light really does bounce off beautifully. And when you have an old house like this, I think you just kind of stay out of the way of the bones of it that are really good. And what I mean by that is like the beautiful window trim and the beautiful windows, it just really 